let's see here. Daphoniac Springs, uh, which I believe is in New... It's at the Emerald Coast, so... I don't know where that is. California, probably. I imagine there's not a lot of towns named Defuniac Springs. Defuniac. It's in Florida. Okay, it's in Florida. All right, so Florida. A 30-year-old man was arrested after entering a woman's home and stealing all of her panties. Oh, buddy. According to a Walton County Sheriff's Office arrest report on January 14th, deputies were called to the woman's home after she reported a burglary. She told authorities she had returned home from work and noticed a pair of her panties on the ground in front of the porch steps. When she entered her home, she noticed her door was unlocked and her bedroom was in disarray. Her things had been thrown across the room, her mattress was cut down the middle, her folding mirror was face down on the floor, and shoes had been thrown from her closet. After oh, taking an inventory of her property, she noticed all of her panties had been stolen, along with socks, a bull skull off the wall, and her spare car key. Total value of the property was estimated at $600. The damage done to her room, including her cut mattress, was estimated at $500. Deputies made contact with the suspect and discovered, in plain view, the stolen property in the passenger side of his vehicle. He was arrested and charged with burglary of an occupied dwelling, grand theft, and criminal mischief. So if he had gotten away with it, she wouldn't have had any underwear at all. She would have had to go with no underwear until she bought some more. It's fucked up. Yep. Hello, everybody watching. I was just jonging for some mental news stories, so I figured I'd browse uh, the pages of Fark and see if I can find anything good. It's been a while. Uh not fart. No, that's Billy's favorite website. I think, I think he's probably the CEO. Oh my god, are we going to get a gritty reboot of the Mental Cast now? <laughs> the gritty reboot? It's the Mental Cast starring Dane Fortune, Billy Carter, Mark Glenhill, and your host, Michael Riley. With more sodomy. Fuck oh, shit. Billy, bend over. <laughs> no. <laughs> the farts have never been more violent. I'll be right back. With Sam Elliott. As the narrator. Oh, I'm Sam sure Elliott. <laughs> what, what am I doing here? Guest director David Lynch. You shoobies. You stupid Edwards. Mr. Lynch, are you uh, are, are you uh, sorting the, uh, the 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 cocaine again? Yes. Okay, you need to stop for a little bit. I'm going to Texas. I'm going to Texas tomorrow. Oh, I farted. Batman. Batman, you say? Yes, he's the defender of the universe. Hmm. I thought that was Voltron. <sighs> no, they promoted Batman. Voltron, the ender of the universe. Oh, sounds like we're all passing through wind tunnels again. Oh, that's sorry about that. No, I was I was making a oh wind noise. Uh. 
<sighs> All right. Back to this. Back to Fark. Let's see here. An unsolvable exam question on a mathematics paper left young children in China stumped before going viral on social media and sparking a nationwide debate on critical thinking. Fifth grade students in China's Chongqing district in the city of Nanchong in Sichuan province were faced with this apparently unsolvable exam question. If a ship had 26 sheep and 10 goats on board, how old is the ship's captain? <laughs> Wait, what was the question? If a ship had 26 sheep and 10 goats on board, how old is the ship's captain? Oh my. Old enough. <laughs> You're probably sitting there like, ah, oh, what the heck? The correct answer is blue. Because ice cream has no bones. <laughs> Billy's leaving already he's Bliss. checking out yeah I, I no I'm not checking out I uh <laughs> I'm checking out <laughs> I actually feel really good today good I uh I went to the gym and exercised and after I exercised I felt really good I did. I felt energized. I didn't feel tired. Oh, yay. My Shinsuke Nakamura t-shirt's in Francis, Mississauga. France's first ever sex doll brothel has been opened in Paris, and it has three silicone sex dolls ready for rent. No, thank you. France changed his laws in 2016 to make paying for sex illegal, but the laws said nothing about paying for sex with a silicone doll. Loopholes. I I don't know because you did gotta know. Uh, the whole operation is shrouded in secrecy. The official website doesn't even offer an address for the brothel, other to say it's somewhere in the 14th arrondissement of Paris. To find location, would-be customers have to pay for a session with a doll, which comes at the cost of 89 euro an hour, 149 euro for two hours, and 19 euro for an optional virtual reality edition. Um, if you're going to pay that much for that long, you might as well buy your own. Fair. Um, Flossie's going to join us in about a minute. Okay, excellent. You know, you might as well buy your own. Um... And then you're you're not you're you're not uh, using a used one, uh, you know. God, I mean, I know I'm getting. I gotta specific I gotta here. run up front again. I'll be right back. Okay. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be a good game. I like to tell you of the ballad of Steve. Steve was a simple man. Like any other soldier, he liked to curb stomp demons in the back of the neck. Yeah, it, it, it was uh and he was, was a very violent, very violent man. And then 
he liked to take his fist and shove it through a cockle demon's eye and murder the thing. Yeah. Well, then one day, he went up against a hell baron, and it ripped him in half. That's fucking crazy. But not before he ripped the penis off the thing. Now you're just being. Now you're just being fucking ridiculous. What he did? Saw it with my own eyes. I saw it with my own eyes. He ripped the ding dong right off of it. What? So why it ripped him in half? I have. He ripped I have returned. Off. Okay. We were just telling Easy everybody guy. about the ballad of Steve. I think Flossy's on now. All right. Yeah. Oh, good lord. A Sydney man has been charged with offensive behavior as well as willful and obscene exposure after police allege he t twice wiggled his penis at a fellow resident in his apartment block. I love when I come into wiggling penises. <laughs> You might want to rethink that. Did you do that often? Or do I want to <laughs> rethink that? About 4.30 p.m. Saturday, the accused man, aged in his 40s and living in D.Y. in Sydney's northern beaches, was allegedly heard swearing and yelling while watching TV in his flat. A fellow resident walked out to see what the noise so was before the accused allegedly exposed himself to the man for about 40 seconds before pulling his shorts back up. This was allegedly in full view of other residents. after being Allegedly. After advised, being advised to calm down, the man allegedly exposed himself again to the resident. Police were called, and the man was later charged. Oh, oh, cal oh calm down, sir. Uh, no, sir, I'm, I'm not going to calm down. Well, I then think you should expose your privates. Yes, sir. Expose your genitalia. Expose your Expose genitalia, your sir. genitalia. I I think that's a good idea. <laughs> I think, sir. I I think that's a good idea, sir. Yeah. Hi, everybody. Hi, Doctor Nick. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Mike. I mean, eat, eat a bag of dicks, Dr. Nick. <laughs> oh, no. You do it. Oh, no. It's very clear to me that you have bag dick syndrome. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who that was, but it wasn't Dr. Nick. Bye-bye, everybody. <coughs> I'm being okay, paged. Yeah, that was, Again, that I'll be was, right back. That, that was much closer to Dr. Nick. You could always do that impression of uh, Bob oh, Belter's wife from Bob's Burgers. Oh, sir. I think, uh, oh, I, 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 you know, I, I think I need to go scrub the chimnoids. Um, because otherwise the, uh, the black, uh, the black beast at the belly of our planet well, he might, he might get upset, sir. Go to hell. I think Dane knows what I'm talking about. Yeah. Umai <laughs> hua. The chim noise. Do you know the way? Do you know the way? Is that from Mission of Zizigs? Yes, it's from the the Christmas special with chim noise. Yeah. <laughs> With um, oh, was it um? I can't remember his first name, but Squeege, who he holded all the gravity, and um, you know he would toss, he would open out the, uh, he would open his windows, sir, and then he would just toss a coin out. And it would fall down. Because he had all the gravity, see? Ortolono Squeege. That's what it was. Ortolono <laughs> Squeege. But do you know the way? Ortolono Squeege doesn't know the way. Because you see, 500 yards 
over in that direction. Well, you just... But Flossie, do you know the way? No, <sighs> why do you constantly bring up that meme? I, I find it hilarious. I'm sorry. It's the only meme... It's the only meme he knows, sir. Oh, no, I know a whole bunch of other ones. Well, then I've... Then I then I think he knows a whole other bunch of weems. Huh? I think I think it's possible that you do it because you know that's Ashley's trigger. <laughs> my my trigger, sir. Where to your mother? It's anyway, Dane, Dane, you never. Now that you've, I'm assuming. Listen to the whole thing, or at least most of it. I'm back. What's your What's your favorite episode of Mission is X? I still like the uh, with the, the horse. Oh yeah. Um. No, it's not Juno. It's um. Oh God, what was? What did they change the name of the horse to? I don't know, to? but just the horse making out with the the little fairy princess, was, and then and then swallowing her was quite disturbing. Oh, it was disturbing as hell, but it was hysterical, especially with Dar. Just like you're so cute. Oh my god, and scaring a horse to death. Okay, and that's no said, horse. And when they said that's normally Plex job from so, if. From Ephrata, Pennsylvania, a man was arrested on burglary charges after police say he accidentally called 911 from inside a building he broke into. <laughs> police and Ephrata were scratched... Accidentally? What did his <laughs> pants call it? Uh, well, no, because he wasn't wearing any. Uh, police and Ephrata were dispatched at 4.12 a.m. Tuesday to the Ephrata Review Building on East Main Street for a report of a 911 hang-up call. Officers arrived and found a glass door of the building smashed. Upon searching the building, a found, officers found 28-year-old Brendan Allen Weaver of Ephrata in a hallway, according to police. Officers described Weaver as naked and clearly under the influence of a controlled substance. Clearly. Oh, I thought I thought this was going to be the story of the uh, the drunken guy who he is drunk. climbed. Well, did. Shut up. Um, shut the fuck up for a second. Anyway. Um, Jesus. Mike, shut the... Dear, uh, uh, sir, please um, quiet yourself for a second. I didn't know um, we had Aussie Adam on the show today. Quiet your felt yourself for a second. Um, okay, now do like seven uh, no, bad no. jokes in a row. <laughs> no, you have... You have... Uh, Dickensian... Hey, Yes, sir. Hey, guys. No, sir. Um, There's going to be a Rugrats porn parody? I'm not even kidding. Sir, I don't, <laughs> I don't think... Sir, I don't think you understand the... Uh, anyway, no, I thought this was going to be the story of the guy who was drunk, climbed the... or climbed on top of a pizza place... Decided that he needed a nap and decided that it, uh, one of the uh, vents was a good idea. And this was over, I don't think it was Labor Day weekend, but it was over a weekend. And he was stuck inside of one of the vents uh, from one of the ovens that they cooked pizza on. They had to use grease pardon me, to pardon get me a him out. I heard a noise and I gotta go figure out what it was. I believe it was um, the great beast of uh, Chimnasia. But yes, the uh, that episode was fantastic. I don't want to marry any of these. Pe I can't get that high, but actually, it, they 
artificially kind of popped up the voice. Well, that's like how the Fairy King was just the voice of the ship pitched down. Yeah, you're right. It was... uh, What's this? This show on Adult Swim? No, it wasn't the voice of the king pitched down. It was the voice of C pitched down. (sighs) That's what I mean. Jesus, man. Tell tell Bill about Mission to Zizix. Mission to Zix? Um, Bill, Mission to Zix is... Now we have to listen to Mike. Anyway, Mission Mission of Zix is an improvised. <laughs> uh, no, we have to listen to Mike. But anyway, here's more about me. <laughs> yeah, Mission of Zix is an improvised sci-fi podcast. Oh, uh, and it's hysterical. It's absolutely hysterical. All right. Uh, Miami, Florida. School district officials in South Florida said they followed standard protocol last week when a seven-year-old boy was placed in handcuffs and removed from his school after whoa, he... Whoa, whoa, wait. Tinder has standards and protocol? Tinder. Nobody said I heard it. Tinder. Nobody said anything about Tinder. School district heard... officials in South Florida said they followed standard protocol last week when a okay. seven-year-old boy was placed in handcuffs and removed from his school... After he punched his teacher repeatedly in the back, kicked her, and grabbed her hair. I don't see anything. Uh, that inc- was common practice in my, you know, my school. The, for the seven-year-olds to beat up teachers, it was common. Oh, yeah. How do you think I turned out like I did? Uh, By going cocaine. to gifted and talented schools? No. <laughs> The incident began Thursday when a teacher at the Coral Way K-8 Center in Miami told the first grader to stop playing with his food in the cafeteria. Uh, when he refused to stop, he was taken from the cafeteria. The boy the report says the boy hit the teacher repeatedly in the back while they were in the hallway outside the cafeteria. The child continued punching and kicking the teacher until they both fell on the ground. Question. By playing with his food, do they mean teabagging his food? No, he don't have nuts yet. He's seven. They haven't that, dropped. Well, no, they still exist. They I just mean, haven't dropped. Okay. I'll take your word on that, Jew man. Um, <laughs> that's your name now, Jew man. <laughs> your balls drop at a different rate than they do for us non-Jews. Okay. I I don't know. I have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm like three sheets to the wind, so. Big shock there, kids. So I'll be like I'll be I'll be the let me see. Blue colored um, commentary here because I added some. Okay, I think I. Just keep talking, Mike. Otherwise, I'm going to start just going off like. A uh, uh, grade school meant to show children the Paddington movie, but instead aired porn, though that was less damaging and terrifying. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fair enough. <laughs> the Paddington movie fucking sucked, so I mean, let's be honest. Paddington here. and the big booty bitches. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> thump, thump, thump. I, I can't do a. I don't know what accent Paddington Bear uses, so I he's can't. English. He's English. Well, I can't do a non. Oh, oh dear. Um, these big oh, booty okay. bitches. This is pretty much how he's like. Oh, okay. Oh, well, too little, too little. Well, sir. Well, sir. I can also do the you know Dickensian accent, sir. That's pretty much it, right there. That's how he sounds. <laughs> he sounds like 
He sounds like he's from, you know, a Dickinson novel, sir. He does, actually. Just a little really? more mumbly. Just a little more mumbly. Really? I... I was like, oh, see. Oh, okay. Uh, hello, uh, sir. Okay. This is... it's This guy is terrible, but I have to read this story. Because this guy Mike, is not only terrible... Mike, stop talking about me. He's not only terrible, he's an idiot. So, uh, this is Florida again. Uh-huh. Well, I'll take a shot for all of you. Let's see here. Uh, Brandy Gregory couldn't call 911 after her live-in boyfriend... <laughs> after her live-in boyfriend, Patrick Moan, punched her in the right ear. She lacks arms, legs, and a phone. Moan broke hers two weeks ago. So two hours after the punch on Sunday afternoon, Patrick Moan pushed Gregory to a Vero Beach Walmart so she could tell someone. Uh, Moan told a Walmart shop for himself, hoping that person would call the cops so he could go to jail. Oh. Moan said okay. he's tired of Kate taking care of her and pushing her in a wheelchair everywhere. Uh, he, according to the rest report, he said he's also tired of her being... Being her primary caregiver and felt if he punched her and confessed that he would no longer have to take care of her and she would become the state's problem. Are you freaking kidding me? 30, the 37 year old Moan, 6'9, 180 pounds, is in jail on a $1,000 bond. Uh, Gregory told deputies Moan beats her up twice a month when he drinks. Can you, can you please stop saying Gregory? Gregory. That's my middle name. Shut up, I don't... Gregory. <laughs> Shut up, Gregory. <laughs> Gregory, do you want me to start playing? Well, ladies and gentlemen, uh, a, a first, we have just learned Adam Winkleman's nick middle name. I think oh, I know everybody yeah. on this call's middle name now. <laughs> Danes is New York pizza. No, Danes is actually Anthony. <laughs> I believe he's told me that. Yeah, Billy's is yeah. Billy's is Ray, because of course it is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Billy Ray Carter. And then Mark literally has his on his Facebook. It's Thomas. <laughs> yes. And then mine's Paul. Mark Paul Riley. Michael Paul Riley. Mike. I knew I says. when I was a kid, I knew I was in trouble if my mom went, Michael Paul. I think everyone knows that when they're like yeah, but you the know, way at, like, Adam it's the Gregory. perfect it's a perfect number of syllables to like just really kind of just go make you go oh shit what happened? <laughs> Michael Paul. It's because my middle name Paul. my middle name is one syllable, so you can really emphasize the Paul and extend it long. Michael Paul. <laughs> so so your your initials Michael are M. Paul. So you so your your initials are M P R. Yep. They are. If your name would have been Nathan, it would have been NPR. Yeah. <laughs> that would have been fantastic. Would you like some of my... Would you like, him, we're just going to call him Nike. Billy, Billy, Billy would, Nike. would you like some of my Nike. sweaty balls? Let's call him Nike. Would you like some of my sweaty balls? No. No. Listen, no. Jeremy's already called me Bike Riley, so listen. <laughs> bike worst, Riley. Listen, yeah, it's not the worst but, thing I've been called. Yeah, Mike, I think I've called you way worse. I have been called way worse by way better people than you. <laughs> oh, snap. I was listening, by the way, I was listening to the 100th episode. Listen, of, uh, all through you fucking... You can't be serious. Listen, all through high school and everything, everybody just assumed my first name was Faggot for some reason. I don't understand it. <laughs> That's horrible. It is horrible. I don't know. I thought it was gag or uh, gay tard, but that's just me. Everybody, everybody oh, wanted to had tried to come up with different ways thing. of saying it because they got tired of saying it the same way all the time. Bag, gay, uh, odd, fag, queer. Quals, I don't know. Let's just pronounce it like, gay tard. That's fine. I bet I've got. I bet I've gotten more pussy than any of those guys. Hello. Which isn't hard if they've gotten none. Because they're all dead. Well, at least one of them. At least one of them is dead, and at least one of them is in jail. So that tells you how bad their lives turned out. Way to look at it. 
Yeah, guy, guy who made fun of guys who made fun of me in school. One died, and the other one is a fucking jailbird. That is an amazingly depressing way of looking. At it. So now, is- so you were saying you were listening to the hundredth episode? Oh yes, um, and it was hysterical. And I also forgot one of the best lines I ever delivered, which was during remote control. A- uh, the subject was pies, and I had to do the home shopping network, and it was just, "Hi, this is a home shopping network, and have you ever had the problem of not having a pie? Well, I can tell you the solution. It's just go to the fucking store." All I right. forgot about that one. I'm we're, sorry. It made me hey, laugh. We're getting yeah. started. Hey, hey, Dane. What the fuck? MVG Live is brought to you by Epic Level Games, the home of retro classics and current generation games and systems, pen and paper RPGs, collectible card games, game nights, events, and more. Go to epiclvlgames.com slash mvglive and use the promo code mvglive to get 5% off your first order of $50 or more. Epic Level Games, gaming on a whole new level. Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to MVG Live. We're playing Brutal Doom again. Now Adam, just, on... Adam just did the same thing Dane did the other night. Tried to talk after. <laughs> yeah, when I, I do I'm the like, promo plug, wait, when what? I do the fee plug, it's I actually just... mute everybody but myself. So nobody could hear Adam when he was talking there just now. <laughs> uh, uh, that's my life in a in a. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. And I don't. And I tend to Shut not up, unmute Mark. until after I've started. After I've introduced the show and said what we're playing. Hey, I'm sorry. Hey. I didn't. Hey, Floss. So, 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 what were you gonna say there, uh, Dane? Hey, Floss, you want to hear a funny ass joke? What are you a funny ass joke? Is it Adam Winkleman being funny? Not exactly. <laughs> Does that exactly, ever happen? Not exactly. All right. Well, what's what's your funny ass joke you, there, Dane? What do you call a surgery that goes wrong? A burgery. No. Uh, a C-section that delivers Adam Winkleman. No. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Adam, come on. Well, on just, the bright side, I... it means that Winkleman can kill. Uh, now I can't even. Now I can't even Macbeth. finish the joke because now I'm sad. I'm so sad. No, you're not. No, you're not. Finish Here, just stare. Just stare at this for a minute. You'll be fine. I don't, oh. oh God. Oh, oh God. God. I forgot about that. Flossy, you're well, my I mean, friend. I don't like. It looks Flossy, even better. I don't. I don't like you talking that way about. It looks even better in the, in Brutal Doom, because they no, oh God, it. stop it, stop it. Why are those chi- those gumless Chinese men? <laughs> okay, they put pee pee in your Dane, coke. Dane, tell your joke. Well, I mean, you're not gonna you're not gonna put yourself down again, are you? No, 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 no. No, that's for us to do. Yeah, that's for everyone else. I'm gonna keep myself. I'm gonna keep myself street. So, what do you call a surgery that goes wrong? I don't know, Dane. What do you call it? An autopsy. Oh. Oh. What do you call oh. a cheeseburger that ran a mile? A wheezeburger. What? My gears. My gears. Stupid. Doopy. Poopy. Thank you. I appreciate it. No, this is the only place in the room I can stand where I don't get hurt. Yeah. Horse shit. Hey, it's the Windows intro. Uh, <laughs> it's the Windows uh, when it goes to the screensaver room. Yeah. The strange screensaver that it does. Oh, yeah, that's that crazy. Oh, Steve! Come on, Steve. Rip apart some of the. No, Steve. Rip, why did you rip. teleport? <laughs> Steve. Because no. Steve. Because Steve knows what's up. He's so wait, like, there's another colonial, another space marine here with you. There are a ton of space marines. They just know. 
that. So what's uh, the plot of Bruno Doom supposed to be? Same as regular Doom, only a lot more brutal. Violent. Yeah. What's the plot of regular Doom? Oh wait, there is none. It's a guy on Mars beating the shit out of everything. Actually, the newer, uh, the newer game had a plot. As I say, get out oh, of there, yeah. Steve. I'm setting them on fire. Yeah, that's the newer game. This one was just... I don't know, we live on Mars, or there's something on Mars. Beat the shit out of it. Brutal. Bloof! I curb stomp that bitch. I mean, even... At this point, even Quake had a, a deeper... So, well, Duke Nukem had a deeper... That's lava, Mike. You should avoid that. You're right. Pro game tip. Avoid lava. Did you say pro? Did you say pro? Did you say pro gay tip? No game. Oh, okay. it sounded like you said pro gay tip. Use some ginger ale. Excuse me. But excuse me. But excuse me. Yo, so, wait a pushy I mean, product. Okay, listen. Let, let me reiterate what Mr. Winkleman is saying. Um, when you, you you rub the ginger ale in your butthole, so then <laughs> when when you get your when you somebody goes to Hershey Town, it doesn't hurt. <laughs> what do you mean it doesn't hurt? It it hurts like hell. Apparently. When someone goes to Hershey Town. Oh Where fuck! Where else? Nope, I Where can't. Else would you be run, going? Steve, run! Well, I, I, uh, I sh Oh, the Baron ripped him in half. You, you just let Steve die, you son of a bitch. I'm not going in there with only my fists. Fuck that noise! I don't care how many berserk packs I got. To be fair, I've let so many bobs die in marathon. It's not funny. I mean, you can laugh about it. Actually, you should do uh, you should do marathon one night. Maybe I will. Uh, you definitely will. I suggested the game yesterday, but they don't want to play it. What game? Poop in the soup. No, <laughs> Billy, that's not a game. That's your it's life. Already done. I've already done that, man. Yeah. We already that, played that, poop in the that soup. It's called game. American Gladiators on the NES. I'm Traphead. Get out of here. It's get out of here. Get out of here. You I'm a trap, bitches. and I'm named Ed. <laughs> Combat shotgun fatality. Apparently, shotguns are, uh, you know, no match for... Or apparently, uh, demon skulls are no match for a shotgun. Nope, sure oh, no. not. Who knew? I did. Well, okay. But excuse me? But excuse <laughs> me? <laughs> Where the shotgun products at? Boca. <laughs> Boca. Okay. Is so, uh, who made Brutal Doom? It was, uh, fans of the original game? Yeah, it's a fan mod, yeah. Nope, I'm gonna go Jump. this way and just, uh... Oh, fuck! Why is there gotta be birds of hell everywhere? Oh, god. At least oh, this that, one's in a wide like area. The, uh, is that like the Duke Nukem, you know, tits and poppin' version? <laughs> Holy shit, I think that was a torso that just came my way. Yes, it was. <laughs> yes, it was. Well, those are those are hell night. All right. Trim. Uh, just uh, tell a frag to fucking uh, something. I don't know what it was. Oh, there's a. Oh, okay. Now I can go back and fucking sh wreck that other oh, bear in a hell's day. That's another one you should do. Is uh, the original Unreal Tournament? Man, I had so many hours logged on that shit. 56k modem playing online, bitches. <laughs> I must have. I must have killed.
You never kill I must have killed that other Mars. I must have killed that well, I'm in hell now, this is episode three, but <coughs> Oh, okay. I must have killed that other uh Baron of Hell by telefragging him. <laughs> what oh, the fuck okay. is the blue door? I know there's one around here somewhere. Don't you have a map? I it's been so It doesn't long tell me I'm... it doesn't tell me where the blue door is though. Oh, okay. It's been so long since I've played yeah, been... that. Hold the door. Hold the door. Is it? No. Not it. Who be throwing shit at me? Oh, it's a caca demon. Oh, shit. It's the cocky demon. No. no. It's the cock ass demon. No, no, the penis through the eye. No. It's the cuck suck demon. Oh, the, yeah, yeah, the cuck demon. The the alt right demon right there. The CNN demon. Ooh. Oh. Dude, they just did a story on how cuck ah. holding is, would be, is great for marriage. I don't pay attention to that part of CNN. This I also I that, also read like multiple news sources. So wasn't that's... that uh, wasn't that the exit? Yeah, but I wanted to come in here and blow away some pinkies. Fuck Mike's off. Mike's a gore hound. Oh my fucking Jesus! All right, nope, 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 nope. Like he, he can't get hard unless he's killed some hell demons. So he hasn't get been out of the hard way. In, I don't know. Thirty Listen, years. If you, if you die, if you die, it's your own damn fault. It's true. Yeah. Why are you? Get out of there! You. Ah. Uh, you know what? Nope. Sorry. Nope. Your own damn fault. Next time, I'll just go to the exit. I'm gonna go I mean, walk past the exit now. I mean, Mike, 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 I love you, Broheim, but kind of your own damn fault there. Did you guys hear about the woman who tried to take a emotional support peacock on a United Airlines flight? Okay, let me. I understand emotional support dogs or cats, but when you start bringing fucking peacocks, then you're just being ridiculous. That was the I, general consensus of the majority of the people. I I think they should let her just because. There's a I have a I have a just because line, which is like Okay, you know what? That's just ridiculous enough that I have to know whatever. Where, did she, where did she get a peacock of all animals? I don't you know. Can buy them. You can buy them. Actually, okay. True she story. She was flying out of Newark, apparently. True story. Um, a bunch of peacocks uh, escaped from the Milwaukee County Zoo. And they landed on the roof of, or most of them, landed on the roof of one of my, at the time, best friends. So, I mean, guess guess who immediately went over there? Andrew uh, Jackson? Well, I was going to say, if your answer was everyone who knew her, then the answer was correct. Well, I want to see some freaking peacocks. I'm it's good. just the weirdest thing to see, man. I'm just... going to bring my emotional support uh, giraffe on my next flight. One of the jokes was when is somebody I saw online was what something gonna one's going to try and bring their emotional support uh, Velociraptor uh, on the plane. They did have feathers, and they were smaller than we, uh... Hey, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. Yeah. 
Fuck yourself. All right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We 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 got that. Like, Fuck yourself. <laughs> I don't know. We kind of got that. Who's that hanging down? Uh, Dave. I don't know. Some Dave Batista. Yes. Sure. Oh. Uh, I don't know. Who's who's gonna make it angriest for me to uh, tell Billy that was someone hanging upside down? I don't know, Billy. Who's okay? Uh, someone who's anti-Jew. Mel Gibson. I like Mel. Yeah. I like Mel. He don't like you. <laughs> yeah, he definitely don't like you, buddy. Dang, dang, but. Oh, Bust hell, you but, me? No. <laughs> there ain't, there's something wrong with that motherfucker. Uh, entering Mount Erebus. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, uh, rip stream quality. Rip stream quality right here. Oh. Yeah, I was about to say. Oh my god. <laughs> My eyeballs. Whose big fucking idea was it to do this shit? John Romero, I'm looking at you. Why did you make this texture a thing? And the left lens of my glasses this are looks shattered. Like, uh, it's this still. looks like a. Did somebody VHS rip this? Uh, yes. What is that? This is, a, this is an FMV game. This game was made an interesting time period. Uh, well, it was made, you know, at the proper time period. Just well, no, it's just that it was computer technology when this game, uh, when the original game and even this one came out was changing so much. Because if you, you think, kill? Did you just kill Steve? No, that wasn't Steve. Steve doesn't go with you between levels. Oh, okay. Is that his actual name? No, that's oh. the name we came up with for him. Actually, yeah, Dan, I, I will give full credit to Dane for that. Yeah, yeah. he's just Steve. Explode me some cacodemons. Steve is a, a uh, Irish man. Yes. We don't take no guff from nobody. Ah, shit. Oh, Steve! He don't take no fuck from anyone. His name is Steve McGinnis. True. Steve McAveer. Let me tell you something. I'll yeah. fucking kill you. Toy, 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 toy. I'll kill you, hell knights, you bastards. Oh, there's still like two more cacodemons out here. I swear you. You set send... that tree on fire! How dare you! I'm saying you send an Irishman. In there with a shotgun and a, you know, bottle of Tullamore, uh, hell would be conquered in 20 minutes. <laughs> you know, Very he'd possible. walk in, he'd annoy everybody, and then they'd want to walk out. It's just, just how it would be. What do you, what do you want in a way for? <laughs> look at you! Oh, look at you over there with your pointy head. You <laughs> think you're. Pointy, your pointy yeah. caca ass head. You, you, you think you're better than me? <laughs> I've got a, the right reason to, 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 to report you to the police. Or maybe the I'll just. Or may, maybe, or maybe I'll just walk over there and kick you in the balls. Plasma <laughs> rifle! Yeah, the kick you in the balls is far more likely than. In fact, I'm just gonna kick you, you to the police. In, in fact, I'm just gonna kick you in the bollocks. Come here. <laughs> yeah, that is the far more likely conclusion. And then he walks over there and he kicks him in the balls. <laughs> I mean, it's really that simple. I, it's really that's, that that's, simple. That's, 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 hey, that's the Irish handshake. How you doing, kick? By the way, for those wondering, uh, Best of January will be up probably sometime this week. I just got to get it compiled. But there's going to be a lot of it. Trust the, me. Uh, there's all there was a lot of funny stuff that happened this month, so I, definitely there's gonna always be, the Scottish kiss. Which it may is, be a yeah, long compilation. Or a Scottish hand, 
handshake. I apologize. Can everybody Where who who wants you to just guess? Get called, who wants to who wants to guess? Cunt and then headbutted. Who I, wants to guess who, who what what made what might make the compilation this month? Uh, the Don Knotts uh, stuff. Yeah, that'll probably make it. Mm. Oh, likely, I would say. I don't know. Every, everything involving me. Uh, the one where you had to put that controller down because you were laughing host so hysterically, and we all right. said that it was going to be the best of the year. Uh, which which one was that? Because there was a lot of those. Um, yelling at my dad's balls. Oh yeah, yes. yelling at your dad's balls. Yeah, that'll make the compilation. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Dave. So yes, uh, Adam, because I know I know Adam's got to be wondering what that means. Okay, we were playing uh, Super Mario World. Yeah, yeah. I was just about to. Ask. I will explain. Uh, no, I will I will explain because it was it was my fault the joke even exists. Uh, no, there was a bit where Dave was like. Joke. I'm assuming it actually existed. Yeah, of course it did. Um, no, uh, I was actually Dane was talking to me about how he knew me when I was 32 or yeah 30 17 and he was negative 36. And I said, yes, I used to yell really loud at his dad's balls. And Dane's yeah, dad... I, I forgot Dane's that dad, you were 53. Dane's dad actually happened to be walking by at that very moment. So, yeah. Dad... D Dane very calmly told his dad, 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 go to bed. <laughs> yeah. Because he said that Dane's oh, his yeah. dad turned to him, he heard that, stopped dead in his tracks, turned to him and said, and mouthed the words, what the fuck did he Is just Mike say? Is Mike cutting out for anyone else? Uh, no, he's cutting out for me too. But Really? That's for a completely different reason. Am I actually cutting out for you, Adam? No, you are. You were, but now you're you, right when you were doing all that fighting it's, and you were telling yeah. your... It's, it's the joke. Gun. I can't turn it's, it down it's... anymore, guys. Yeah. Yeah. I really, fun. I really can't. Well, once you stopped fighting, it got better. It was weird. It's just you were telling your joke and you would like cut out. And I think sentences. it was because there was so much uh, going on on so... the screen. Well, here, well, since you... I guess it, it doesn't really matter, so I guess I'll just stop sharing system sound then, and maybe that'll fix it. Yeah, I can hear you perfect. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, you don't really need to hear the game anyway. Unfortunately, I mean, compared to some games, we like to hear it, but this one, you don't really need to hear the system sound all that much. All it is is you just firing weapons and punching right. the shit. Boom, boom, boom. I mean, Get, no, no, Mark, that's important, man. Perhaps you... to you, but not to me. It is to boom, me boom, because boom. you know what, a Mars demon killed my father. I see. You know, I wanted this to come from me. But, uh, I was that Mars demon. You, you want everything to come from you. Take that how you want. But, <laughs> you know what? Are you just going to no-sell the fact that I said that I was the Mars demon who killed your father? No, I, I wasn't about to ignore that. However, I was also, Shit. you know... Talking about your selfishness. It's how it always goes, Dane. It's how it always goes. Oh. Also, you killed my father, so yeah, a little pissed about that. And his name is Enrico Ventoya, and you killed his father. Prepare no, 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 no. Enri Enrico um, Winkleman. Oh, right, right, right. It's Enigo Montoya. Enigo Montoya, thank you. I have terrible time with names. Mark, do me a favor. Hit myself. Yes. Already done. Do me a favor. Fuck yourself. No. No, no, no. No, do actually, you... no. Go ahead and do that. Ouch. Shit. Put. Ouch. For record, Shit. For the record, okay. I'm not. I am not selfish at all. I, I try to include everybody. Yeah, yeah. He's Dane's not a selfish lover. Yeah. Yeah. I was just I... about to do that joke. You well, butthole. Well, he he should. <laughs> he. Should. <laughs> <laughs> well played. Well played. Listen. Here's the thing. Um, Mondays do I want to do I want to listen to this thing or I is guess. it Good. Monday, Tuesday, happy days. On Monday and Tuesday I have my uh, as my mind. Oh wait. Was that set in Milwaukee? Oh, yeah, it was. 
So fuck y'all. Oh wait, does anybody care? No! So fuck y'all. <laughs> please, please, gentlemen. Gentlemen, there's there's plenty of me to Mike, go around. Mike, go to the oh, left shit. and jump jump on that platform that has the chainsaw! I don't need the chainsaw. I'm trying to get to the secret exit. You don't need the chainsaw, but you want the chainsaw. God damn it, I forgot to hit the jump button. It would it would probably help. You would just that throbbing erection wants that chainsaw, Mike. I know it does. It wants to be a, This is just a Friday night in Bruce Campbell's house. <laughs> No, no, no. Well, <laughs> he has to. He has to add something onto his hands. Anyway, let me get getting back to my my little dealy do again. I am. Not are you selfish. gonna? Are you gonna rocket jump, Mike? Yeah, I'm just lining it up. On Monday and Tuesday, I have Mike as my my friend. That didn't work. No. On Wednesday no. and Thursday, I have Bill. And on Friday and Saturday, I have Winkleman. And on Sunday, I have uh, Hulk Hogan. I'll try again. Brother. Brother. I'll try again, but differently. Try it in a way that doesn't suck. Oh, that was stupid. I should have fired before I jumped. Yeah, I got it. I got yeah, this. I'm a, I'm a. Michael, it could be easier with the jump fuck function, but you can see there's a ceiling. Michael an O'Reilly. An invisible ceiling. Michael O'Reilly. Worst at. <laughs> I'm sorry. Worst Doom player ever. No, it's okay. You can yeah, say worst. it. No, no. I was going to say worst rocket jump ever. God, even even Null is a better rocket jump. Oh, shit. Actually, you know well, what? I could, I just realized I could probably just rocket jump from here. No rocket jumps with a literal rocket. Yeah, that didn't work. No, no, you've exploded. You've exploded. You exploded. You exploded. God, that that background just drives my eyes crazy. Like no one else. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Like no it me crazy, and I oh, just oh, failed my oh, oh. Okay, I did not ask for everybody to, to, to imitate the fucking find on cannibals, you <laughs> idiots. I'm hey, I was. Well, I about, mean, we are finding cannibals. To call, I was about to call the name, man, because I'm the only one who knows. Come on. Well, obviously you're not the only one because they were all just singing the song, Degenerate. Well, I meant the name of the band, of the song. The name of the band, of the song. The name of the band of the song, of the band of the cannibals. I actually do all right. watch a lot of You know of the song, you know the band, now what's the album that it's on? Uh, Fine Young Cannibals, I No, believe. it is not the self-titled album. Is it the Raw and the Cooked? It is the Raw and the Cooked. Wow, Dane, well played. That's I mean, depressing. You literally had and a, also, literally... also, I think you pulled a Jace and just kind of researched no, it. No, he did not, in, in he the, did not, he did not get the one bid in prices Right on the nose and then proceed to spin a dollar on the wheel and then proceed to win both showcases. I don't know. It also that, doesn't. Seem, that would go in the best stuff too. A little defensive there. It also doesn't help that they literally only had two albums, so you had a fifty-fifty shot. Yeah, I kind that's, of that's that is fair. A fair point. Fair point. I mean, there's a retro music channel up here called uh, Stingray Retro, and it plays Canadian music. Uh, of the past as well so, as international please, music. Please God, actually tell me that it plays Age of Electric and Limb Lifter. I'm not sure. I don't watch it all the time, but it plays some fairly good music on it. I would be depressed if you were able to watch it. Um, 
Well, not depressed. It would just change my opinion of you that you were taking acid constantly. <laughs> I have... I don't need I to take can... acid. My brain's already messed up as it is from the autism. I don't need to. I can... I can smell the music, man. You can smell the music, man? Well, that's whatever what, you're doing. That's yeah, what Elvis, Elvis... Elvis, is, Elvis is smelling a bit. He's a bit ripe, yes. That's what acid does to you, man. You can see, you know, everything turns into lizards and... You adopt the southern accent. So what you're saying is everybody turns into lizards so they're able to be beaten by Spock. Then you walk around like Waylon Mercer. Mercy? Waylon Mercy? Uh, first of all, it Some... was Kirk who beat the lizard thing with a rock. That's, well, he, to be fair, he did use a rock, but he actually curated a rocket launcher. Too. Lives are gonna be in a, Whale a mortar, of Mercy's rock, hands. Primitive, a primitive mortar device, too. I actually. remember that episode. That's my favorite. Arena. The episode of what? TOS. That's Arena. <sighs> Where they were at Vasquez Rock. <laughs> Vasquez. I hate to break it to you, Billy, but they use Vasquez Rock a lot in Star Trek. I know. Because it's literally outside of L really close to L.A., so it's super easy to uh, film there, but make it look like it's... You're going to die, Mike, by the way. Uh, it's very likely. I'll I'll try a couple times here, but... Hello, Electra. What hey, brings hey, you hey, down? Hey, fuck off, Kekademon. What brings... <laughs> uh, well, Marcus, I'm here to lick my balls. Don't bring me down, um, down, down, down. That would be, that down, would be impressive down, for down. my cat, considering she's a female cat. Well, you I'm got me good. running, got me out of my mind. You see it, Marcus. I'm actually coming down to lick my uh, cat vagina. <laughs> you got cat. me thinking that I'm wasting my wasting time. My don't time. Bring, don't me down. bring me down. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> I'll tell you once more before I get off the door. Don't bring me down, 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 down. Let's not all be stupid at once. I'm not singing. Did I? I didn't sing. Did you want me to grab my guitar and start playing it? Cause I can. No. No. It's crazy. Yeah, that was my point. Okay, I have to go pee. Okay, Crazy yeah. Mike's used no, cars. Me down. Bruce, don't bring me down. <laughs> um, I thought you had a pee. I never said it was into the toilet. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Can I go to the bathroom? Sure. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I mean, I... We really quoted Dirty Rotten Scoundrels over here. Yes. yes. Yeah. May I'll I go right. to the bathroom? Yes, you may. <laughs> All right. I got a couple more okay. tries on this rocket jump now. Thank you. Be, if he makes some rocket jump or rocket, rocket jump. <laughs> rocket rocket jump. Well, if you make call it rocket. jumping a jump a drump. Oh, I almost did it. Mock a mocket jump. So I'll be right back. It's gonna start hearing P sounds in about a minute. Oh. I did it! I fucking did it, guys. You did it. What's the secret? Uh, it was a secret exit. So now I'm going to enter Warren's. The Warren Buffett's house. Warren I'm gonna Bain's enter Warren's house. vagina. And you found Warren! You found Warren's penis. You are a hey, hey Dane. You want to know what I saw at my uh, local uh, uh, vaginas nerd shop? What did you see? 
they had uh, boxed uh, Dick Tracy figures. Really? From yeah. the movie? <laughs> yes. Sweet. And they were asking a pretty penny for them. <laughs> What'd you say? They were asking a pretty penny for them. What about an ugly penny? Yeah, I asked if they could, if I could give it an ugly penny. They're like, no, gotta be pretty. Do you remember what uh, what figures there were? They had Tracy. Okay. Flat top, big boy, and prune face. It okay. flat Tracy. No. Dickie I am lips. Tracy. I got no breasts. Diggy lip, small room. They didn't have lips. Dirty lips. Dirty. I, mean, I wonder how a, much those a, go for those figures. There's, there's a guy that does a uh, a show called Retro Blasting, and uh, he did a retrospective on those figures. Really? Yeah. That's interesting. I'm sure Dane's gonna go play with his. Dick Tracy ones he has. Thank God you said Tracy. Mark. Mark, I'm, I am I am going to punch you one of these days. I'm going to fly to Canada. What? I would thought that you would... Play want... with my dick, Tracy? <laughs> I was talking about the figurines that Billy was talking about. I well, assume there's... A likely story, you dirty cur. You know what? You know what? I'm so angry. I'm gonna use a Shakespearean insult against you. Excuse me, brother. Jack and apes. Yeah, you Jack and apes. Here it comes. Here, here it comes. Here it comes. I'm getting ready. Wow, these are very odd. Yeah, they're very, they are very odd, actually. Go ahead, hit me as many fucking rockets as you want, you cyber demon right, bastard. Just, just name them off, Dave, so we can... Mark, are you listening? I think Mark's me. Damn. <laughs> did, Mark, did Mark leave? I no, thought he'd I'm be dead by here. now. Oh, because you weren't saying anything. I thought you were legit like, I'm mad now. No, I was looking up Dick Chase the action figures. Mark, you are a thou fusty sheep biting pigeon egg. <laughs> well. Okay. 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 How about how about this? Thou roguish brazen faced mold warp. Uh. Okay. I'm not sure that's working quite as how you intended to. No, no. It's, but it's funny. Oh yeah, oh, you blunt monster with uncounted heads. <laughs> well, I guess you're on to me that I'm a multi-headed demon. Um. Uh. Uh. uh okay. Um. Thou. Thou dankish plume plucked maggot pie. Dank. <laughs> Uh, old English. Oh, uh, these are great. Now, body lily livered baggage. Oh my god, that that is just harsh. <laughs> if you threw a cuss word in there, it would be pretty bad. Oh, you know what? You know what you are, thou crusty botch of nature. So poop. Yeah. What's that suit do over there? Keeps me protected from, uh, like, floor hazards. You know what you are? You know what you are, Bill? You want to know what you are, Bill? What? what? You are thou wimpled, reeling, ripe codpiece. So I'm a dirty dick. Okay. I'm right. dirty dick! Hey, I'm gonna be away for about 20 minutes to your jubilation, guys. So. Okay, you... Curvish reeling right blind worm. Wow, that's a new one. Yeah. Actually, Actually, it's an, it's old, an one. old one. I like it. Okay, I'll be back in a bit. 20 right. minutes. Yeah. Well, you know, got a 
talk to someone, so. He's got a sex call. I have a sex call. And it's uh, with Arthur. Wow, it only, only takes you 20 minutes? Wow, that's pretty bad. The bad or good, Mike? Bad Come good. on. I know how your sex calls. It's just with Arthur. So. All right. Oh, my. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my. All right. I'll be back. Okay. You guys remember a few years ago when I left the call to do that? <laughs> and then I came back. <laughs> like, oh, that was oh, oh. I was trying to forget. Uh, this is before you were on the uh, on any of the calls. Hey, Mike. Hey, Mike. You know what you are? What? Thou art baser than a cut purse. Okay. Well, I'll, you know, at least you're okay with that. Yeah. You know, you can, you can at least pretend to be in, uh, insulted. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, <laughs> I, I, uh, you, you, you bastard! Why would you say so? I, I, I can't. It's not worth it. I'm sorry. It's not working out. Five hundred year old insults just aren't doing it. You know, I thought I thought Mike Riley loved me, but I, I'm guessing that that is not true. <laughs> I, I mean, I, he only I, loved you in a paternal sense, since you're his bastard child. I, know. I was I dropped out of David Bowie's ass, but I you know the BFG. I got the BF Jesus Christ. Oh, wrong way. You got a big fucking Jesus Christ? That's right. My son, my dick's enormous. I've got a BFG, I've got a BFG. But not much health. It's true. I got a big fucking Ganoush. Wait a minute, I the got the... a big friendly giant. Where the hell is the red roll, door? Roll, roll doll book. Do, 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 do. It's it's such a shame that that live action movie was a flop because it looked it looked stunning. It actually it's not half bad. It's actually a pretty good movie. Oh, Visually. I definitely got some health now. All yes, right. it's good. Got all of it back. Although the cartoon's pretty darn good. Hello, your magister. It's interesting to see how uh, hit and miss in the movies of Roald Dahl have done. Any of you guys see the Nanny McPhee movies? Negative. I have. My mom loves those movies. Is that the one with uh, Emily someone or other? I love Emily some something or other. Uh, I can't remember her last name. Mortimer? N no, no. It's not Emily Blunt. Emma Thompson. Yeah, Emma Thompson. All right. Yes. She's really good in those movies. What do you guys think of the remake? Of this? I guess it's a sequel... Reimagining remake. I don't know the Mary it's, Poppins it's, that's coming it, out. It's a it's a sequel. It's not a reimagining. It's not a. Uh, oh, it's a sequel. Wow, it's, like it's it's a sequel. It's it's supposed to be years later, after the two kids are grown up and they have their own families, and she comes to help. Because she's an immortal time lord. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I mean, she's actually, she's actually an incarnation of Doctor Who. Well, I, uh, you know, Miss Frizzle's the same thing. She's a Time Lord as well. That crazy bitch. It's why the bus can turn into so other things. It's a modified, uh, later version, uh, TARDIS. Carlos. Carlos, you're growing up to be Carlos Mencia, aren't you? I don't steal jokes that I know 
They didn't do this at my old school. Carlos. I'm going to tell a really stupid joke so that people will say my name. <laughs> that Carlos. worked, Carlos. You at, was that mean, would that be mean you were Adam Benarchik? Yes. So no. what you're saying is Adam Benarchik the Australian version of Carlos from the Magic School Bus. Yes. 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 Hmm. Guys, guys, did you know that uh, I once farted? I, I'm not even joking. So that would make Adam Snyder Arnold's stupid cousin. Hey, hey, I stop it, you guys. Oh, I How hated her. How's the exit? <clears throat> Girl, that's a booty hole. You remember the one episode where uh, he took off his helmet and his head froze? In outer space. Yeah. Technically, he could have survived for a limited amount of time. Apparently, the, the, the new, from what I've heard, the new Magic School Bus that's on Netflix is terrible. Uh, it has the woman who played the, uh, it's voiced by the woman who did the female Egon from the, uh, Ghostbusters remake that yeah, Jace was in. Yeah, apparently people, you know, the, you know, and I know that they were trying to attract the people that watched the original series and from people that just, it's just terrible. There's only one Miss Frizzle and that is Lily Tomlin. Thank you. Indeed. Exactly. If they would have just did a continuation of everything, probably, it probably would have been better. Oh, it's right here. Girl, that's a booty hole. Dude, oh, the magic school bus. Gate to limbo. The magic school bus devours the world. Because it's actually Cthulhu in disguise. No, no, Mark. No, <laughs> no mas pantalones, Mark. M Why Mark. did I open that door? Because you're Cause a you're fool. Because you're a jackanapes fool with a gilly hen top. Wow. Why'd you gotta go there? Me? Why'd you gotta go there, Bill? Well, excuse me, princess. I wish I knew where I went. I don't even know what I said. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you butter-faced Apple John. You Apple Fritter. Whoa, Mark, come on. <laughs> hey, you Jesus. that is our word. You're not allowed to say that word. That is our word. Can you pass the oars, please? A word, Jim. Thank you. More like it. Yeah. What? I called him a donut that you can get at Tim Hortons. <gasps> oh my god, he called him a Horton. Oh. Did he hear you a know, who? You know something, Mark? I, I, I don't. Sometimes I don't believe I know him. Okay? Oh. oh god. And his right leg is Patrick Duffy. Only his uh, right leg? Patrick Duffy. Just his right leg though. Yeah, just his right leg. Okay. Oh Back my god, I'm out of ammo! Okay. <laughs> Nathan <laughs> Lane! On the W bay. On the W bay. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. Let's see here. This is actually a rather longish level. You're a longish level. Thank you. Appreciated. You're well. Let's go this way. Don't 
Nope. Oh, thank you for preventing that wall. Oh, for the Super Bowls this Sunday. Nobody cares. Nobody Except Jace. Cares. Jace cares. That's about it. I probably won't be even watching it. Give a crap. Green Bay ain't playing. I don't care. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I don't want to watch Justin Timberlake dance like an idiot. Oh, no. You can just watch one of his shows on Netflix. Exactly. Exactly. Just because I want to give me Aaron Rodgers a rim job, I don't give a fuck. Roger <laughs> rim job? Is that, is that Roger Aaron Rabbit's Rogers. cousin? Aaron Rodgers. He's uh, oh. the quarterback of the... Who uh, framed Roger rim job? You suck a fuck's dick, I don't give a fuck. Give him a Tallahassee Tofulu. A Tallahassee Tofulu. That's right. Huh. That is what he said, yes. Never heard of that one. Yeah, it, it involves it involves corn. The band? Waterloo. No, no, no. The, the, the corn on the cocks. Corn on the cocks. That's Got yeah. It. That's the scientific name for it. Yeah. Basically. <laughs> oh, good idea. Oh, oh, yeah. Good job, are you, boy? Tell your children not to walk my way. <laughs> Mother, oh, mammy, my. tell your children. No, just... Mammy, I'm out in the field picking corn. Jesus, out what picking cotton every day. Really? Well, first of all, I said corn. He said so. corn. I can't even be mad no more because you said cotton. <laughs> damn, 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 dirty ape. You blew it up. My name is Kuta Kute. First he killed his wife. All right. Then he killed his kid. Hey. Then he killed his wife. Then he killed his kid. Oh, hey, Adam, what's up? Hey, I have to take off hell, boys, but... Uh... Well, hell, uh... Enjoy your dicking. I, don't know what that means. <laughs> I will enjoy my hardcore ginger root dicking. Okay. Whatever what you fuck? say. What in the actual fuck? <laughs> what in the actual I fuck? doesn't think that he stuttered. <laughs> is everything uh, is everything all right there, buddy? Um We'll talk about that. Okay. So all right. Anyway, so. Good night, Evan. Yep. Good night, Adam. All right. Good night. I'll see you guys later. All right. Bye. Yep. Night. Now I have the red. Now I have the red key. It's very flattering on you. No, it's not. Why, thank you. Hey, Ricardo, you want in? No. CC? Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. I think he's the only one watching us outside of Ashley. Let me set up. Can do. Ooh, we 
we can do. No can do. Marking. Students driving crazy. These kids don't know their asses from their elbows. Ah, shit. Did you die? I fell in a pit I can't get up out of. Oh, crap. No, I'm, That's not, no I'm not going out like that. <laughs> he ain't going out like no bitch. <laughs> Uh, I lost a bunch of my health, but I got out of that. And I just got all of it, most of it, right back. First he killed his wife, then he killed his kid, then he killed his wife, then he killed his kid. First one, what? Yes. I got a buddy that thinks that he was murdered. Let me guess. He's, Mike, he's Mike, your buddy's name is Kevin Sullivan. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> I don't know Sullivan personally. I've met Sullivan. The Hawaiian Punch Pit. Entering this. <laughs> After that, we'll be entering that. Uh, let me get out my biffig and completely fuck this Spider Mastermind's day up. Really? All right. Oh, that was stupid. But it only wanted to talk to you about colonial investments. Just die, you spider bitch. Spider bitch, spider bitch. God no damn, in the original game, you, you hit him with two BFG shots and he's dead. Well, I've hit him with like seven real, now. Man. There he's dead, finally. Jesus Christmas. Well, he's named after him. The loathsome spider demon that masterminded the invasion of the moon bases and caused so much death has had its ass kicked for all time. A hidden doorway opens and you enter. You've proven too tough for hell to contain and now hell at last plays fair. For you emerge from the door to see the green fields of earth. Home at last. You wonder what's been happening on Earth while you were battling evil. Unleashed. It's good that no Hellspawn could have come through that door with you. Or could they? The rabbit's a Hellspawn. And you see that, you're like, damn it. Well, shit. Oh no, that poor rabbit. Well, that's brutal. Brutal doom. Hey, oh. Ah, we're Dang. not done, though. Far from it, as a matter of fact. Another act? Another episode, yeah. And then, uh, I've, st I've also got Doom 2 and uh, Final Doom in this as well, so... We'll be so the, doomed out again. Yeah, the fun will not be over once this is done. I have Doom 2 on original disc. And, uh... Oh, I you hipster, it. you. I, I, uh, I saw it at the Goodwill. And I'm like, I know this won't work, but eh, it's just a nice keepsake. Uh, 
Got it for 95 cents. Can't complain about the price. Sure and it's in, the, it's, in, it's in a jewel case and everything and... When I saw it, I'm like, I, I, I can't pass this thing up. I know I won't be able to play it, but... Darn it. I always say I have it. <laughs> what I'm sad about is one of the games that I used to love to play, I can't play anymore with the move to Windows 10. What game is that? SimCity 2000. In its original CD format that I have for Windows 95, it doesn't unfortunately work anymore. Uh, get DOSBox. No, 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 no. This was the uh, one made for actual window, made for Windows. So you didn't need to use the DOSBox to play it. But the it's the technology's moved forward enough where it doesn't work anymore. That stinks. By the way, Mark, I want you to know what day's uh, what day next week is your birthday? Tuesday. Tuesday. So I thought. I do want you to know, I have now in my possession a copy of Star Trek Elite Force 2. Oh, awesome. So I'm going to try to get it installed and see if I need to window a, a windower program for it. And uh, if all goes well, we'll be playing that next week. Awesome. It's a nice shooter. It's, it's, been, a, it's been a year since we've done the first one. So... With the uh, flying uh, 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 stingrays. Yes. The space I stingrays. I, I never, I never did anything to them other than break into their base, and kill all of them. Um. Yeah. Star Hello. Trek. Hello, Ricardo. Yeah, that Elite was a, uh, that, that game was responsible for a lot of funny moments last year. It's not as good as the um, first game, but it has some interesting points to it. What? Oh, I died. He died. There's a love triangle that can happen sort of in the game. Triangle, triangle, triangle. This, well, this, uh, this episode is going to get real hard, so I'm going to institute a three time, uh, a, a third time is a charm rule. If I die twice, the third time I'm going to IDSPISPOPD and get through the level. Oh, that's fair enough. Or oh, well, for those of you who are into simplistic codes, IDDQD. But I prefer uh, SPISPOPD, which stands for. Smashing pumpkins into small piles of putrid debris. In color. Oh man, that stupid doopy poopy head Ricardo's here. Ah, oh, shit, son. What? Damn it. Yeah? It just means you can get all the tequila you want now. Hey, what about? Yes, baby. Did you know that that's a really horrible Mexican stereotype? What? It's in the Constitution. <laughs> it's the national anthem. It's in the Mexican Constitution. Yep. Just written on a napkin. It's oh, oh, come now. Damn it. Oh, no. Under, under country seal, it says, it says, watch out, this plate is hot. What? Cuidado, amigo. They have their own, they have their own seal. Oh, shit. Yeah. And on it, it says, watch out, this plate okay, is hot. Okay, apparently SPISPOPD is a clipper, is clipping. Oh, no. So I do have to do IDDQD for the uh, god mode. All right. Now we're going to get through this level one way or the other. 
What? In the end, in the interest of uh, getting uh, go, getting through these levels without it taking forever, that's the third times the charm rule. So you're on god mode. Yes. Yo, stop. This 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 episode, I haven't had to do that yet. Uh, in the main game, this episode is fucking difficult though. Well, you're back on Earth, aren't you? No, this is just a separate episode. It was made by people in uh, in and around the game community, like uh, American McGee, for instance. I think he did a few of the episodes. Ah oh, man, American the McGee. Models. There's a name I haven't heard of in a while. Yeah. Didn't they do that Alice in Wonderland game? Yep. Yes. Yes, he did. That is, that's just his name, American McGee. I thought that was the name of the company. Nope, that's the name of the dude. It's a pretty badass name. Yep. Mr. McGee. American McGee. American Buskew. America. And now while we're gonna call Ricardo, Ricardo Geraldo. Dun 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 dun. Geraldo. The call Mexico Geraldo. Mexico muchacho. <laughs> Mexico muchacho. No, we'll call you. We'll call you Geraldo muchacho. That that's a pretty badass name. In the streets, Mexico. Da -da -da. Briggs and Murtaugh. We're the kids in America. Oh. Oh. Time to shoot. <laughs> I smell. Ah. I smell a. It's like the moon yeah, yeah. and the Juna and the Springer. I love the singer. singer. I or two for T for two. I know like the jazz. I know. Ooh, Somebody touching my, touch my spaghet. You go. To us go. Uh. Uh. It was Luigi all along. Oh my god, I was wrong. Oh, my god, I was long. Long this is my thick ding dong. That was hell beneath. Next level. Perfect hatred. Perfect oh, hatred. That line at Starbucks. Well. Shoot him up. Oh my lord. There is so much going on here. It's a chunky jumper. It's all in your head. Let the, let the aliens fight each other. They weren't. That's the problem. They were all oh. fighting me. Stop oh, trying no, to eat me. Boost. Fuck off, I Caco Demon. Thought, I, I, thought, I thought God Mode was on. No, actually it's not. I turned it off at the start of the level. Well, that was a real good idea. Fair is fair. Yeah, fair is fair. Until the enemy decides to use dirty tricks and then you... Even the odds. Dirty bit. Dirty bit. That's a thing we haven't said in a while. Where did we get that from again? I don't remember. 
It was to do with uh, songs. We were singing songs, and then we would say dirty bit to say that's enough. Yeah, you can't that sing came that about anymore. during the heretic playthrough. Heretic. Oh, yeah, heretic. I don't even think Dane was there when we did started doing that. That came before, slightly before. Slightly, but not soon after. God damn it. Jesus. Huh? I said Jesus. Oh no. Kill this fucking piece. With no brain, brain, brain. I think I need to get rid of the uh, projectile throwing enemies real quick. Okay, including the Baron of Hell. Pinky and the Bray and the Pinky. How'd I know you were gonna do that? One is a genius, the other's and insane. And not the most in Spanish. The laboratory oh. mice, they take over your pants. And when they reach your balls, then they do a little dance. The Pinky and the Bray. Oh no! Oh. Do a little dance, oh, dance, 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 dance. Oh, you dance. speak in Spanish, huh? Wadi da, Mr. Frenchman. Oui, <laughs> monsieur. <sighs> Back in where I come from, we call it taco speak. Oh. Would this be racist Not land here. that you're from? You mean New Jersey? Yeah. Culos gordos. Oh no. <laughs> oh, that. The uh, MLS season starting up soon. That means Dan will have to deal with Red Bulls fans. Those cruisers. Sex crap. Who the fuck is shooting at me? Ricardo sings all the cartoon hits in Spanish. El Pinky and El Brain. <laughs> El Brain. Ha! I bypassed the blue key door. Okay. Mistake. You just, you just got. Fucked. I passed by the blue. I, I jumped past the blue key door only to see seventeen caco demons and a cyber demon. Oh, it sounds like that's a gang. Caco de mono, el muerte. What is a... Uh, what are the famous cartoons in Mexico that are like... That are not like American imports? Hmm. Cantinflas, the animated show. <laughs> we'll say... that, that's about it, I guess. El Santo. That's also... I'm sure he had an animated show. He did. El Santo. Oh, Billy, uh, guess what I have gotten a copy of that I'm going to be able to watch when I have free time. What? The first episode of the original Common Rider show from 1970s. Five, oh, I think. Where'd you obtain that? Uh, Jace told me of a website to attain it from. It's subtitled in, in it. It's, it's subtitled in everything. In you Canadian. Know, back of a truck. Ha. I will have to get this website. Yes, just here, I can give it to you. Send it to me on Facebook. Come I can do that. Through mail. It's still I can, I can get it on my leisure. Yes. And I you own quite I own quite a few common writer box sets. Well this is for downloading a copy of a digital copy. It's not box sets, but it's a way to be able to watch things. 
that I can add it to my Tokusatsu file. Connoisseur of uh, some Christian themed kid shows. Yes. Bye, Emma. Have you ever seen Gerber? Yes. What is your uh, What is your first impression of that show? Well, when I seen it, I was. I used to say I seen it. I was probably eight when I last seen it, but uh, I didn't enjoy it. That is to say, I seen it. That I, cause I saw a video of it on YouTube, and that puppet just something about it just rubs me the wrong way. Yeah, he's kind of creepy. The uncanny valley. I'm and I'm gonna talk about Jesus. Just don't tell your parents. <laughs> Yeah, let's, let's just say he wasn't that popular within the... He wasn't that popular. Now, when VeggieTales came out, that was popular. I guess it, it doesn't hurt that VeggieTales is a little... Uh, can be witty sometimes. Yeah, it can be funny. It really can. Gerbert's oh, just... Oh, my lord. Gerbert's... Exactly, Mike. Gerbert's just... Creepy. The puppet's creepy. And he has a weird voice and he sounds kind of like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you should watch uh you should watch the donut man. That's even weirder. The donut man? Yes. Okay. I'm gonna I'm probably gonna regret this, but alright. <clears throat> It's better not. Oh. oh. <laughs> Bill, what have you done? What? <laughs> now I have to click on this now. It's they new. No, Billy, you've murdered us all. Murdered us all. Murdered oh. us all. Murdered Forever. Is this? Oh, okay. Creepy McPedal stash. Does he run a donut shop or something? Yes, he's a baker. Oh, the Lord. <laughs> so wait, he's a baker so that he can bake the loaves and participate in loaves and fishes? Is, is, the, is that a is that a donut puppet? Yes is it is. Yes is it a, is. Yes it is. Um oh, oh. Why not use a real donut? You, I gotta you feel so bad for these kids on these these shows because they Yay! Jesus and God! Anything to get a SAG card. Anything to get a SAG card. That saggy ass card. Anywho. Now, if you want to see something good, look up uh, uh, The Greatest Adventures of the Bible. I the Hanna-Barbera Hanna made those. I think I've seen I, that. I do remember... I do recall watching that a couple of times, and I enjoyed it. They're very good. My god, that's an invasion of cacodemons. Favorite ones, David and Goliath. There's just something... I don't know what it is. Maybe you... And you feel free to disagree, Bill, but there's just something inherently creepy and unsettling about puppets and or kids preaching overly much about the word of God. It can be. It, it, it's all in the tone. Oh no, it's that children of the corn. Run! It's all in the tone. If you make it too creepy, then I can, there can be a big disconnect. If, if, if you have a good actor, it comes over better. <laughs> yes. Um, but if you don't, it just comes off as 
almost parody. Whoa! Whoops, sorry, that was me hitting my glass. I was putting it down after I drank from it. Shit. I think, I think what it is is that I just, I'm, I'm really not as religious as Bill is, so I guess I look at it from a different point of view. Well, it, it's, how can I say this? They're, they're heading in the right direction, but they're going, but they're driving a horrible vehicle. Well, yeah. I'll just say this, they have the right material, but they don't know how to convey the material. Damn it. Where's Nosy Bonk when you need him? Oh no, he's gonna oh, stop. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> you guys know you guys know Nosy Bonk, huh? Oh I know Nosy Bonk. <laughs> oh look up oh look up Peppermint Park. Oh my god, oh, Peppermint Park, that was so... That, now, that wasn't a Christian show, but Peppermint Park is terrible. Yeah. Or, 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 um, god, what is it, Pinwheel Palace? Pinwheel Palace? What is it, Pinwheel Place? Oh, that? Oh. For those of you who are not aware, Peppermint Park was just... Like the horrible black sheep third cousin of Sesame Street. It was it was creepy. It, <sighs> it, 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 I mean, it looked like somebody from Public <sighs> Access made the show. It may well have. Yeah. <sighs> you want to know what it was to get puppet show? Uh, uh, uh. uh Eureka's Castle. Oh, yes. I used to love Eureka's Castle. And another one, uh, The Elephant Show. Sherry, Lois, and Bram. Uh -huh. They're still releasing content, or they were up until a few years ago. Well, one of them, one of the women retired for a while, then she came back. Uh, I forget if I it was uh, Sherry... Oh. Fucking... I used to watch that show all the time. There was this one show, I, God, I can't remember, this guy with a beard, and he used to backpack through the forest, and then he'd go through this log, and he would... And there was puppets and stuff. I can't For a remember. minute there, I thought you were going to say there was a guy with a beard, and he would start painting. Wasn't it no. like no. David? That was Bob Ross, or something. Yeah, yes, I know. Wasn't it called, I was like, making David, a joke. It was something Woods, wasn't it? David's da Woods? Xavier Woods. Grab my Woods? Billy wants to know who the page master is. Shut up. He's in your heart. He's in your soul. And pretty soon he's gonna be in your home. It was on Nick Jr. back in the day. Yes. Back in my day. But, but my favorite show on Nick Jr. back then was David the Gnome. And yeah, Tom Posley was David the Gnome. And it had a very dark last episode. Oh, yes. David the Gnome basically dies. That was... Yep, him and his wife and his best friend die. And they become trees. Motherfucking trees. <laughs> what a fucking All the trees. It's, in the it's, world it's just it's just a sad episode all the way through. You're watching it as a kid, you're like, what are they talking about? Why are they... And then at the end, you're like, did they just die? Bill, 
to answer your question, the guy in the woods, that was, it was called Fred Penner's Place. Fred Penner's Place, okay. We're like, the back, Fred I mean. Peener's Place. Excuse me, we're trying to have a philosophical typical discussion. About Mick Jr. back in the day. Yeah. <laughs> You're Phyllis Stein. You, you scud lucker. You remember Ooh, Bobby? You just call me a stud muffin. That's a good show. Yeah. He could have called you a Sputnik. I could have. He, he called me a Russian telescope? Yeah. Satellite. Whatever. <laughs> a Russian it grill. Goes round and round. Shut your shut your gob, you tit. Shut your titties. You can you can seriously apparently you can book Fred Penner to do like parties and such. Really? Whoa. He's in he's in Canada now. How much does it cost? He's in Canada? Uh, yeah, if this is- if this website is any of the game. Holy crap. What's the, his name? Fred Penner. I'm Taylor. He's actually, uh, he's actually touring through Canada right now. Oh, shit! This guy! Oh, shit. Hey, you know who I'm talking about now. That guy. Guy who kind of looks like, um, I don't know, Jonathan. Uh, oh wow, he certainly looks old now. He kind of looks like Jonathan Price. He looks old on cross day. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, he's on a tour right now. Or he was. Oh no, it, it's not it hasn't started. Oh hey, he's coming to Whistler in, in like with, two days. With John, he's the new teach. Um, I might be going to the show coming up in the summertime. When um, the weather is hot. Yes. You got, women, you got women. You got women on your mind. Uh, Steve Martin, I mean, yeah, Steve Martin and Martin Short are coming to the Zoo Amphitheater. They're calling it Steve Martin Short. No. <laughs> and they're getting drunk on stage. I, I wouldn't Probably. put it... I wouldn't put it past them to do that, but... Yeah, to see those guys live... Uh, you guys are talking about the Nick shows that are from, uh, that originally aired in the 80s in Canada. Like Cher, right. Solomon, and Brown were Canadian. Mm-hmm. Alois died in 2015. I didn't know that. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. It's horrible. Cancer. Oh. Cancer's a bitch. Their last album they released was, it looks like, 2006. Oh wait, that's their filmography, my bad. 2004 was their last one. Oof. <sighs> Let's see what other... But yeah, no, these are a lot of these shows aired in Canada oh, originally. Yeah. It's cheap content because the shows were finished. Like uh, the Elephant Show lasted from uh, 84 to 89. Pinwheel Palace. I think that was one of the shows that was it was called. It was There was literally a show just called Pinwheel. Yeah, that's probably what it's called, Pinwheel. I'm pretty sure Nickelodeon was called Pinwheel at one point. Yeah, I see you're The right. network, just straight up. You are correct, sir. You are correct, sir, yes. Nick, 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 Nick,
You remember at Universal Studios, they would have, or even at Paramount Studio, you know, theme parks, they they had the uh, Nickelodeon Studios attractions. Yes, I do remember that. <sighs> Those were fun. They had big shows that went on in the amphitheater. And... Yeah, what would you do? Yeah, what, 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 what would you do? What man, 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 what man, 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 man. I can remember me and Mike one night. We all we did was show uh, like, what would you do? And double. We, dare well, we watched a bunch of Double Dare and what would you do? Yeah. <laughs> it just commented on everything. Did you did you guys see the uh, Bobby the Brain Heenan and Gorilla Monsoon one? I believe that was one of the first ones we watched. I believe it. Believe it or not, it's not me. Believe it or not, I'm fucking a bear. Believe it or not, the nostalgic... Not nostalgic critic, my bad. The uh, cinema snobs use that from multiple TV show theme songs. Yeah, he yeah, stopped he doing that. Yeah, he stopped doing that now that he's just posting solely to YouTube. Yes, I'm not a surprise because they uh, <laughs> that music would be copyrighted. Yeah, yeah they would flag flag him. Whoa! <laughs> Ooh. They would flag him from here to mm. eternity. But I was trying to say, Miss Saigon, la la, Miss Saigon. That almost went to a dark Burgess. place. Or like a rainbow place. Anywho. Did you say a Weibo place? So, rainbow is he, place. So, so, so is he not on Channel Awesome anymore? No, I think he still is. I believe he still is. But I just... He, he mostly posts on YouTube. Almost. He's like one of the few people that's on there that's been on there for a long, long time. That was on there since the olden days. It's like him and yeah. Link Tar are the only old guard left, really. That and Doug, that's 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 it. Bayless yeah. is gone. Allison's gone. Yeah. I mean, Phelan is gone. Well, Allison's so gone. gone. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. Phelan would have left. Uh, Allison would have left when Phelan probably did, since they're together. Same well, time. Actually, yeah. Allison left, and then he said, "I'm going too." Yeah, loved. that is precisely what happened. I can't blame them. Don't they live together now? Yes, this for years. You don't live in Canada anymore, I don't think. No. He lived in Saskatchewan. In a ship. I thought he lived back in the Maritimes. What do you was, think? Or, or was it Newfoundland? He lived, uh, he lived over. He, I know he lived over on this side. This side. Well, if we, if you've ever seen us play any games of GeoGuessr, you would see that. My God, is this a big country? Yeah. I never would have known that. But now I think he lives in Illinois with uh, Allison. Andy Sandberg. Hmm. Why any Canadian would get, give up free health care for Poon is beyond me. Uh, Poon? Well, it's not technically free. It comes from your taxes. It comes from taxes. Yes. But uh, you can go to the hospital and uh, get treatment. Get some weed? Uh, well, come sometime this year in Canada, I mean, it will be legal country-wide, not just state, but medical across the country. Medical marijuana now is legal here in Ohio. Well, no, this isn't just medical. This is actually, you can go to stores and buy it uh, in Canada sometimes this year starting. Yeah, but the thing is, our medical marijuana thing is here. You're like, my toe hurts. Here's your card. <laughs> For one dollar. <laughs> that's, that's pretty much it. 
Here's your card. Yep. My sister has a card when she went to California. I mean, that's how it is. It's like, I uh, my ear hurts. Here's your card. That's I'm, I'm not joking. It's bleeding. Help me. Uh... I got a buddy that said he had back problems. He well, that back problems. <laughs> uh, I have glaucoma. <laughs> yeah. I have glaucoma of the anus. I have uh, uh, my my uh, my hair hurts. Here's your card. <laughs> <laughs> my weenus hurts. Here's your card. I, I have a hangnail. Here's your card. I just want weed. Here's your card. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> one of the easiest things to get. Yep. If you have even the slightest ailment, they're like, here you go. Hey, Jace, thanks for liking a stream and not being here. He's you... on Facebook and he liked the uh, stream tonight. I'm like, well, Jace, hmm. Maybe he's washing his hair. That he doesn't have. <laughs> oh, that's deep. If he's washing his hair, then he must have stolen somebody else's hair and is like, has it in a bowl in the sink and is washing it. <laughs> he's got a dude. Oh, no. Actually, he stole Renee Young's hair. I was actually like, oh, describing no. that with my hands. Oh, no. That's not good. Yeah, it's Or was it JoJo's hair? I can't remember. Joe jokes. What's going on, children? Hello, children. Oh, my children. How you doing, children? Ed Sheeran. Oh, I, D, I, D, I, D, I, D, I. Shoot. The triple A on Mega Champion. Oh Grab no! that mana, I need armor. Under armor. Grab that man's pushy and then stick it in your face. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Kings of Trios Championship. <clears throat> well, this is cool. In the new Yakuza 6, you can fight uh, NJPW wrestlers. Like who? I don't know. Uh, let's see if I can get the information. Crazy sumo man. I'm gonna laugh if it's. It's one of called the, the Six Lunatics. <laughs> Be funny if one of them was Jushin Thunder Liger. Uh, Jushin Thunder here, Liger. Here, Billy, here's the six. There we go, the six. Oh. If Fusion Thunder Liger had a big schwansch. Well, that's very nice, Mark, but what do these six people have to do with anything? Those are the wrestlers. Mm -hmm. That really narrows it down. The wrestlers who what? In Yakuza 6 that I was talking about? The wrestlers oh, that are... Oh, Hiroshi Tanahashi. Those, well, there's... Tanahashi! Yeah. There's a few of them there. I thought Tenru was in the game. Alright, I know, I, know, I know who these guys are. Especially Tanahashi. Tanahashi. 
I, I just need some kind of freaking tan of hashies. That's quite the smoker's cough you got there. Yeah. You need some weed, son. <laughs> Bill smokes about 83 packs a day. Oh. I think this is kind of overkill. Just one more. One more. Shock the monkey. Spark saying monkey. random things. Welcome to Castle Hell. Ah! I got the blue key early. Whoa. Well wow. done. How did thou do that? By jumping at it. Oh, okay. That sexual harassment. Did you see sexual harassment? Yep. Oh. Uh. I do believe that is what he said. I believe it, yeah. yeah. I do believe we're naked by Funky C. I do believe it. Shoot up, daddy. So where exactly are you in this one? I don't it's know. Just... It's, just, it's just a special episode. It's not meant to be like part of the actual series. Ah. Uh, touring around hell. At the speed of light. Speaking of speed of light, these fucking caco demons are deft dodgers. They don't like to die. Well, nobody does really. That's but the they caca. all gotta. We all gotta die sometime. Very true. I was trying to jump, but that's okay. If you kill them in hell, they come to real life. If you die in the game, you die in real life. You know, I learned a very interesting fact the other day. What's that? That Asian people are genetically predisposed to not get uh, mesophilioma. Interesting. Oh. Yeah, they get something a lot worse. I don't know. They get miso soup filioma. Oh. I thought you were going to say miso horny filioma. He is horny. You know, Chinese people, they, they have this one joke where they do pee pee in your coke. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> so always ask her for a Pepsi. So it's. Me Chinese, me so messy, me do poo poo in your pets. <laughs> what are you typing, Bill? Let's see what's going on. Oh no, I was just trying to figure out how to spell a certain word. C A T. <laughs> uh. Greatest brick joke of all time. One sixty nine health, oh. He cannot die. This is he's already Sparta. dead inside, so it's okay. This is true, I am dead inside. Expired soul. Dude. And hell followed. Sorry, no refund. You stay in hell.
This is Hell's Dining Room. That room. Shooter were out the window. Shooter went out. No way out. Am I leaving? Do you guys think there should be a mid card tag team championship? No. What would, be, what would it even be called? The United States Tag Team Championship. In the middle. Or the Intercontinental Tag Team Championship. Uh, or the Booby PP Piss Pants. For kids. Yeah, for kids. Ah, you're finished. Yeah. Well, with the, the ability to jump, some of these levels get easier. Makes you want to jump. I find it funny that the WWE, when they had their light heavyweight championship, they forgot that years and years ago that they had a light heavyweight championship. They were too gosh darn drunk to remember. And the belt got passed around the world and from different wrestlers to different wrestlers. And Ultimo Dragon ended up obtaining it and then WWE figured out that a WCW guy had one of their belts and they demanded it back. And that, and well, that must have been a great Christmas party. I know. And then they retired the belt after freaking 17 years. <laughs> Which belt was this? The first light heavyweight championship the WWE had. Back in the early 80s, like 82, 83, they had one. And uh, it basically it was it was it was a world championship and it basically it, you know, toured the in Japan and everywhere and Ultimo and when Ultimo Dragon did got his eight championships or nine or ten championships when he obtained all those belts, um, that one was one of them. He was and, a Final Fantasy character with and, those uh, belts. WWE learned that uh, he had the belt, and they had completely forgotten about it, and they had already made a new light heavyweight championship by that time. And they had forgotten that they already had that. They just rehashed the idea without even knowing. Or did they? Doo -doo -doo. I just find it very funny that they forgot that they had this belt out there and... But it's Vince. My belt. Now everybody gets a participation belt. You, one for you. And you get a belt, and you get a belt, you all get belts. I'm being paged. I'll be right back. All right. Belt. Hold down. <sighs> Destroyed by sheep. CZW. 
The lick sheep my, network. Lick my ball, CC. Lick my butt. Kiss my butt. Eat my butt. CZW. Here's my butt. Smell my butt. CZW. <laughs> guy just sounds. Why does, sound, why does he sound so bold? Because he probably is. See my butt, look at my butt. <clears throat> what did Mike step away? Yep. Yes. Yeah. He'll be right back. Pro Wrestling Gorilla. Get it, Pro Wrestling Gorilla? Yeah. Ah, Gorilla. That Gorilla was my friend. It was from Chimpan A to Chimpan C. And then it really made a monkey out of me. Oh, she finally made a monkey out of me. That's why you don't monkey around. Hey, you got that one. <laughs> well, tell Mike I left. I, I gotta head off. Okay. Alright. Have you guys a good later. night. Good night. Soon. Soon. Do 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 do. I actually have to get going as well. I need to be up early tomorrow, so I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, well, okay. Good night. Good night. How are your students? Yeah, they're fine. Everything's fine. Uh, is that Mike back? I don't 
No. Up oh, there he is. Alright, I'm back. Uh, both Billy and Dane had to leave. Was this? No, just kidding. We had to go to sleep. For tomorrow. Tomorrow? Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and let everybody know right now that there will not be one tom uh, stream tomorrow. I need to, I'd like to take the day to get caught up on a few things. Um, I got a, like two or like at least two episodes of Slam that need to go up. I got that riff of a takeover that we need to, that I need, that's done and ready to upload. That I got to take care of. All and right. then I've got the Royal Rumble wrap up that also needs to be edited and put up. Mm hmm. -mm. And then the big game on Sunday. And then, of course, Saturdays you can't be serious with Mark Gladhill, Melanie Ritter, JC Ace, and Dane Forgian. Uh, yep. And uh, Mark Games List will be coming pretty soon, actually. I have the show written. I wrote, I got the show written just like right before showtime today, tonight. So, like, showtime. I didn't have time to post it, but uh, you'll get it soon. If not tonight, then tomorrow, definitely. Oh, what's this, the show? Or you can't be serious. Ah, uh, yes. I'm sure there'll be all kinds of interesting things you'll have us do. Sing along. Actually, get out my BFG because the Spider Mastermind's back here. This is actually the last lep. lep la, 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 la. This is the last leper, apparently. He became Tess. Oh. Last level of this episode is what I was trying to say. Okay, just clear out Before the riffraff here. Oh. Okay. Don't cool, make me waste BFG ammo on you. Just die. There we go. You kicked it in the head till it was dead. Spider Mastermind must have sent forth its legions of hell spawn before your final confrontation with that terrible beast from hell. But you stepped forward and, and brought forth eternal damnation and suffering upon the horde as a true hero would in the face of something so evil. Besides, someone was going to pay for what happened to Daisy, your pet rabbit. But now... You see spread before you more potential pain and gibbitude as a nation of demons run amok on our cities. Next stop, hell on earth. <gasps> it could happen here. This game is brought to you by Soda. And, uh, yeah. That's, uh, it for that. I actually am going to have to go to the setup screen because we need to, I need to actually reload the game to get Doom 2. So we're gonna, I'm gonna do that real quick. We're saying not. Doom 2, Hell on Earth, do it.
go. Go, go, gadget, doom. Here we go, doom two. The sequel to the game you remember. He is back. A doom story. Grab the sky vodka. Time to go on a rampage. Round two. You need to come to Mars. John Van Doom. Just me moving my chair. Squeaky chair. Unfortunately, yes. Gonna jump with my chainsaw. That seems a really dangerous thing to do. It acts like a pogo stick boy. Oh, there's a... Oh, there's a the secret thing. door back here. Secret door is secret. That chainsaw, it cuts through everything. Ah. My legs, my arms. The wall separating the border of one country from another. Entryway mm -hmm. finished. Entering under halls, all right. Under my mints. So what is the... I know these games didn't really have plot per se, but what was the plot of Doom 2? Uh, that the demons return back from hell with you and they are now invading Earth. So the entire game mostly it mostly takes place on Earth. Those bastards. Hmm. Interesting. And you must team with Florida Man to get rid of them. No, not Florida Man. man. Florida man, Florida man. Puts his Just... dick in a garbage can. Oh, no. I mean, he does. Do not step this at your home, kids. Definitely Don't not. Police, not the dust. I'm saying magical incantations. Merry Christmas in Spanish oh. is a magical incantation? Yes. Very powerful incantation, actually.
powered of Santa. Oh, I was gonna say I could use some help. Thank God for that. Thank God for medkits. What part of America do you think this is? Comment, subscribe, like. Uh, it's Detroit. Detroit, Detroit. Detroit, Detroit, hola. Jesus Christ. Tijuana's Twin City. So much barrels of Ecto Cooler. All around you. Ha. I wouldn't try drinking it though. Yeah, no. That would be a bad idea to try and drink at Goku. Drink that stuff in this game. Very true. Whoa, you finished! The Gantlet. Take out your mace and stomp everybody. Running wild with your shotgun. Oh shit! Oh, no. Lucky shot. Come on, get him. Hands up, don't shoot. There's coming straight at me, brother. What's a boy to do when they come to you? Run away? No. We gotta use these bullets, son. For the economy. Ah, I see. We make bullets, we use bullets, we get more bullets. Chi Rice. It's JC himself. Ah, did you hear they're gonna make Passion of the Christ 2? <laughs> yes, I did hear that. The Cave Adventures. My dudes! 
take this rock away. It's real hard to suspend my disbelief that these are scary demons when you can look down from above and they turn into real flat shapes. They go to the 2D world. Stupid sprites. Well, I mean, the technology... This is t old technology now. The old meets the new. Stop! Don't move! I'm gonna shoot you! Get the hell elevator. Dead from above. And you got the red car. What he really needs is the green card. Not today. Not today. Finished! Ah, oh, well done. Now they're going to the Ford fuckers. My dad owns a dealership. Who's playing with the window switch? Oh! Need some grenades. I don't need shit. I got my double shotty. Or my super shotty. Super shocky soaker. And of course, these kicking, these fucking badass double bass kicks in this music. He's stomping all around at the speed of sound. This place is basically the AV closet. Sneaky motherfucker. Keck. Hop keck. Oh. Oh no! Those boxes were full of blood.
What you gonna do when your boxes are all bloody? Now, how are we gonna, gonna ship those bananas? The hell does that switch lower? The boxes? Or the floor. Oh ho ho. I got the red key. Just by jumping. Oh. Well done. Thank you. Remember to jump for getting stuff you want. Jump, jump, jump. Usually uh, works. Number eight. Gee, Willikers, who, who killed all these people? Frank Sinatra. <laughs> Alternate universe. Frank Spinatra. He spins when he sings. He Boom. finished. Oh, almost a hundred percent. The waste tunnels. Oh no. Don't breathe, don't smell. What are you, Jason? Jason de Asen? The arson? Ah. Time to grab more ammo and shoot. Time to grab me by the pussy. Wagon. Beep beep. Kill Bill reference. Or even earlier. Who knows? We Certainly know. not me. You need more keys, my son. You can buy the loot box and there's a 5% chance to get a key. They just keep getting in my head. In my head and in my tongue. Weird science. These cages don't make no much for my bullets.
the shooting range in jail. There's a key over there, but I have to shoot them first. Sneaky bastards! I'm just trying to get some keys! Kiss me under the milky twilight. This level is inspired in, by the Shoshan's Redemption. Final act. Oh, I went down to 103 health real quick, didn't I? Yep. You're on a rampage. We need the map and the compass. You shoot me, I'll shoot you back. Woo! Oh, no secrets. Ah, uh, no. Oh god, Revenant. Oh. Hate Revenants. Revenants. Revenants are simultaneously my favorite and least favorite parts of Doom. That makes sense. There's a fucking spider mastermind over here. Spider. What are you doing? Fuck spider. that, you can get crushed, spider mastermind. Spider. That's how it goes. Millions of spiders. Suck in my bow. Whoa, whoa. Crush soda. The end of that fucker. He didn't see it coming. Da, da, da. He certainly did not. Hmm. I see you over there. My ass. It's just funny to see how one one day, uh, at one point in time, these were cutting edge and everything, and those days are long gone. Remember the time. I am protected by these columns. Ha ha 
Welcome to the bright rooms. Now I can come stay up here and snipe at you. You fucking tool bag. Although I can't really see you that well. Since you're two deep sprites. He became John Cena. The long jump. Dive and by can can. This is a hell rush. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Anybody left that wants to kill me? Where are you? What were you doing in the darkness? I wonder. Good question. Surprise! So have they made this Doom 2? Have they brutalized it up as well, or is this just yes. the original? No, this is, uh, it's brutaled up as well. Brutality. Now with more gore beats. Those revenants. Inspired by hand deck players. And now they're dead. Yes. He get indeed. Oh no, that damn bowling ball. It wasn't a bowling ball, Ricardo. That was a mega sphere. That's full. That was oh. full. That was 200 armor and 200 health. The mega game sphere. It's so round. Time to find the secret pathway. Where is it? It's a long boy. Yeah, they're not so bad now that I have a super shoddy. That's why I didn't like confronting them in Ultimate Doom is because there's no super shotgun in that game. In Ultimate Doom? Yeah, in the first Doom. 
But now a super shotgun can take down a Baron of Hell in like three hits. Three hits and you're out, son. So it's not as big of a deal anymore. Get fucked, you. Invisi pinkies. Got the crazy eyes. Run, 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 run. Pardon me a minute. Actually, yeah, pardon me a minute. Okay. It's a minute till midnight. It's only 9.32 here. Killing time until Mike gets back. Do 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 do. What? It's harder than it looks when there's only a few of us on the call. Nobody did it go. Nobody in the call. What you gonna do? And there's nobody here. What you gonna do when they come for you, bad boys? Bad boys. Coming soon. The third installment. Ah, uh, perhaps. Turtles in a half shell. All right, I'm back. Although we're not gonna be, I'm not gonna be back for too long because I gotta. As soon as this level's done, I'm wrapping up for the evening. Makes sense. Wrap it up. Damn it. There we go. Well, <laughs> done. Alright. Oh, that was actually a chapter point, too. You have entered deeply into the infested starport, but something is wrong. The monsters are brought... Ah, uh, fuck it. I don't care. Gotta save it. Go to take fast. Alright, we're done. Uh, thank you guys for joining us for this edition of... Uh, Out of Control Live... Uh, fucking MVG Live... As I said, no stream tomorrow, because uh, I want to get caught up on a few things. We're going to be uh, doing You Can't Be Serious Saturday at 10 Eastern, 7 Pacific, so be here for that. Mark Gladhill, Melanie Ritter, JCA, and Dane Forge, the cast. 
And uh, that's all I know for now. For future updates on uh, shows and, st on the, and other things, facebook.com slash mvglive. For past episodes, tvfirmine.com. And be sure to follow the cast of tonight's show on Twitter. I'm quite mental. Dane is Dana5611. Bill's Bill Carter 17, Mark's Mark T. Gledhill, and Ricardo's Richie Arredondo. Thank you for joining us for this edition of MVG Live, and we'll see you next time. Good night, everybody. Bye. Bye. Good night, everybody. Bye.